So Google has recently updated Google Bard and now it is called Google Gemini. And in Google Gemini, you have two options, Gemini and Gemini Advanced as well. Where Google Gemini is powered by Google's Gemini Pro AI model, Google Gemini Advanced, which is the paid version of it, it is powered by Google's most capable AI model widget claims that is called Ultra One. And you can see it is a paid model as of now, but you can start with a two month free trial. And the AI model, which is powering Google Gemini, that is Gemini Pro model, is now also available inside Pavli Connect. And now using Pavli Connect automation, you can generate content using that same model as well. So we are going to see how you can set up this Google's generative AI action step in your Pavli Connect workflow. So here we have created a workflow and here we'll just scroll down and come to the action step. And here in Choose app, just search for Google Generative AI. Just select it. After selecting Google Generative AI in action event from the drop down, select Generate Content and then just click on Connect and select Add New Connection. Now here we have to connect our Google AI Studio account with Pavli Connect and to make this connection, we have to enter the API key over here. Now you must be thinking how you can get this API key to connect your Google Gemini Pro account with Pavli Connect and use it in your Pavli Connect automation workflow. So for that, you just have to refer to the help text over here. Just click on this hyperlink given in the help text and it will take you to this page of Google AI Studio. At this page, you can use the Google's AI model that is Gemini Pro or Gemini Pro Vision over here. Now to get the API key, just click on this get API key button and click on create API key. After clicking on create here, it is asking us to search for a Google Cloud project. So if you already have created a Google Cloud project, you can select it or if not, you can start creating a new project as well and then click on this create API key in existing project. And after clicking on create, you will see Google AI Studio has generated an API key over here. Just copy the API key from here, go to Pavli Connect and paste it over here. And after pasting the API key, just click on save. And we have successfully connected our Google AI Studio or Google Generative AI platform with Pavli Connect. After making the connection, it is basically asking us three basic things. First one is the text. That what is the text? What is the prompt which we want to give to this AI model? Let's say I want to give a prompt as, for example, write an essay on automation and integration. And after entering the text, it is asking us for the models. So here in the drop down, you can see a list of different models you can use inside Pavli Connect, which are offered from Google. So we can see Google Gemini Pro. This is the most recent model which is available inside Pavli Connect. Other than this, there is another model which is supported by or which is used in Gemini Advanced that is Ultra 1.0. Now, as of now, this particular model is not available by APIs inside Pavli Connect. So we are going to use the most latest one that is Gemini Pro over here. And after selecting the model, it is asking us for the method. So do you just want to count the tokens or generate some content using this particular action? So because we want to generate the content, we are going to select method as generate content and click on save and send test request. Now, as you click on save and send test request using Pavli Connect, we are going to take the same text, the same prompt to Google's AI model that is Gemini Pro. And using Gemini Pro, we are going to generate a response, some content or an answer for the same. And after getting that answer here, you can see we have received the response. And in this response here, you can see we have the answer. We have the content generated by Google's AI model Gemini Pro automation and integration, diving innovation and efficiency in modern industry. And here you can see using AI within few seconds, it has written an essay on the same topic. Basically, it has given us the answer for the same prompt which we have given over here. In this way, using Google Generative AI action inside Pavli Connect, you can use Google's AI model inside your Pavli Connect automation workflow and you can generate some content using that as well. So this was just an introductory video that how you can set up Google Generative AI or how you can use Google Gemini Pro inside Pavli Connect. Soon we are going to come up with some amazing automation use cases and videos on our channel using Google Gemini Pro or Google Generative AI tools inside Public Connect and we are going to show you how you can use it in your automation journey. So this is it for today's video. Thank you. Have a great day.